All right, welcome everybody. This is Kashimaro, and this is Street Fighter 4 Tournament Mode. Have you ever even thought that this mode existed in this game? I mean, I bet that those who play this game haven't played this mode for at least a year. And those who do not play this game but like watching it do not know that this mode exists at all. I'm here with a couple of my friends and one absolutely random guy who I don't know but I randomly invited him. One of them is Jumbo, who I'm gonna be playing right now. He's not the master of Street Fighter, I'm gonna say more, he only plays this game for fun, but he's not... I can't say that the guy's not a knob when I see 5 BP, <laughs> that's even possible. Alright, let's just say it like that. He knows stuff. And I can't believe we didn't skip intro. I mean, this is not Mortal Kombat, and yet we didn't skip intros. So he knows stuff, but on a low level. So I'm gonna go easy on him. But I promise that in case this match is not gonna be awesome, I will compensate with some really good match. Alright, tournament mode is basically the more. I can't believe he got me with that. No, that's not gonna work, man. <laughs> uh, it's basically the more fun version of Endless, I can't believe he didn't die there. It's extremely fun and it works really alike uh, the game that I used to play on my channel from really really long ago called Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm, but not gonna say anything more about it. The thing is that it suffers the same problem that Ninja Storm. Basically, why this mode is so unpopular is because there is no reward in the end. If you win, generally nothing is... I, I have to block this. Nothing happens, which is kind of a... I don't know, it loses the purpose. That's why people choose Endless over this mode, even though it is obviously way more fun. Not gonna lie, I kind of want this mode to return in Street Fighter V, but only if they put some kind of a reward in the end. I mean, it can be anything, from just achievement to maybe some skin for the character that can only be unlocked through the tournament. Maybe even some BP? No, that would be weird. Okay, you've got the idea. Well, basically, this is not the only mode. There's also some team stuff, and uh, I think maybe something else. I don't know, I haven't explored it, but... There is a number of them that are just lying there, not being played by anyone. And that's it. This should be the end of it. Or maybe not. Okay, I'm gonna finish this real fast. I remember that it was like the biggest problem of my life when I was playing Dan. Like, there was a time, a long time ago, before I stopped playing Street Fighter, when I was maining Dan, maining him hard, <laughs> that wasn't doing such things, but I had incredible problem with... He's gonna get stunned. Oh, that's a perfect! I can't believe I lost once to him. I mean... Shit! I got screwed by the fireballs, how can I lose to that? Well, I can't believe this guy waited for me. Freaking amazing. <laughs> that's, my, that's your reward for it. Oh wow. But this Satsumaki is gonna get him. No. Alright. I have, I have to first make my analysis about how smart this guy is because he has quite a lot of PP but no BP, so. Shit. I thought I blocked that. He's gonna focus, right? He's gonna focus. Oh, maybe not. Can you react on that? Alright, perfect. First round, just checking around. This could be the end. If he... Maybe not. He could've finished it there. Alright, you don't react in this always. You can actually win this. If I just... STOP! Ah! 
It didn't stop quick enough. Has the super now. Shit. I knew the wake up was gonna come, but damn it. Alright, I'm winning this. Maybe not. Alright, he's smart. We got this. This is my verdict from the first battle. He's not dumb. That means that we get to play smarter. Okay. Shh. I'm concentrating. I'm gonna jump. Shit. Shit, come on! Yeah, here we go. Alright. I might do something risky right now. I need to ultra. Has the super. I will do it. Go! Go, ultra! Whoa! That was, like, super risky. I can't believe it worked. It's all about analysis and prediction. Oh, come on, you should have blocked high. He still has the super. Raging demon dude, come on! That doesn't look like that. Raging demon! Shit, come on. I re religiously love this move. Wow, that, that was the first time this cross up didn't work, I swear. This is the end. I'm gonna do something risky again. Super jumping! Whoa! <laughs> Ma Magic pixel comeback! Denied! Oh. Damn, this guy is amazing. Whew. I heard I can beat him again, but... Jumbo said something. I have to check this out. I mean, this is not a recording time, so I can do whatever I... Yeah, I sure did. Still haven't learned my pattern moves. Shit! Oh my god, no! How did that happen? <laughs> oh my god. This is the law of Street Fighter. Here is the moral. Don't drop your guard. So I'm just gonna run up to him and kick him in the face. And it didn't work and he won. I get cocky. It's like... The principle that my channel was actually all about from the very beginning just worked. Basically, if you are a superior player, that doesn't mean that you can't get your ass kicked. Even though I'm not really a superior player, I'm just some random nub. From now on, even lower than that! <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Damn, I had this! Shit. Alright. At least I can commentate. <clears throat> Evo style commentary. This is a tournament. We should get serious about this. Let's go. All right, it's a match point game. Omega versus the guy who is not Omega. Ooh, beautiful. Not move that I use every day in the ranked. And look, he didn't block that. Beautiful lag there. <laughs> I can't do this. But, you know what's really cool? That this kind of a mode could actually be a replacement for people like me who can't attend or see those amazing players outside of YouTube. Yeah, that was actually pretty damn awesome. And play with them, which could have been quite nice. But, I guess no. Maybe it's just my secret instincts who are trying to tell me Go and commentate on Evo, which could have been incredibly terrible, considering how bad I am at that, but... Damn it! I'm taking what I can here. Anyway, I have a feeling that this is gonna be a close game, because I met both of those players. I wanted to say in the Mortal Kombat. You see, I'm already wanting to go to the Mortal Kombat. Have some... Oh, damn it, that was awesome! Have some stuff to do there as well. But, anyway, I met both of those players in a battle, and I've got to say that to defeat both of them, for me, I have to go full tryhard, so... This is not just a walk in a park. This is a real battle. The winner of this will most likely be the winner of the whole tournament. I mean, mini-tournament, but we have four people out here. I'm thinking about starting some kind of a... I don't know. It depends on how many subscribers actually play 
Street Fighter. I mean, I pretty much sure that a lot of you watch it, but who actually plays it? And if a lot of people somehow occur to be playing this game, we can be doing tournaments around here. Like eight people each Sunday or maybe Saturday and you catch my drift here. Oh my god, this is getting close! I told you this is gonna be close! Oh my god. My money is on... Isn't it mega? I think... No? Shit! How can you lose this? Everyone who I want to win today loses. Props to him for playing as Balrog though. This is not the easiest character to play with. But... Fun fact that the first character that I ever saw in a Street Fighter was Balrog, ba 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 the boxer guy. And basically that was, oh my god, what EVO was that? I think that was EVO 2013 or something, and the guy who was playing as Balrog was doing this great comeback, and the crowd went, oh! I barely understood what was going on, but I just like the feel of this game. I'm gonna talk about this a little bit more in Mortal Kombat, because there is some key elements that create those feels that make me choose Street Fighter over Mortal Kombat, even though I like Mortal Kombat way more, and I'm actually way more pro in Mortal Kombat than in this game. Okay, this is no-brainer. If Dan is winning this, my faith in humanity has been lost. The moon epic music is rising! There should be no trouble. Yeah. Pretty much. I expect the end of this in about one minute. Or maybe not. Stop being so pro! It's just sometimes you lower your guard down to those players and you lose. This actually might happen to this guy as well. Why it's so close? He tried to do an ultra there. Alright. See? As expected for now. No, that was a little bit close. I mean, it's not like I don't want Jumbo to win. I mean, like, it would be really, really strange if he did. Because this guy is pretty damn good. I mean, like, super damn good. But he has potential, though. To be the best Den in the universe. Who's the best Den right now? Alright, if he gets him... If he, if he wins at least one round, I'm gonna do a Den rank. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> he's not gonna win this. What if he's gonna ultra? Random ultras usually work. Like right now. Random ultra. Oh no, you don't wanna do this with him! This is getting close. Random ultra. Random ultra. Oh, here we go! Damn it! Should you get him on this right now? No, don't lose. Don't lose. Don't. It's just a day like that. Everyone who I want to win loses. <laughs> this is so close though! I'm still gonna do the Dan rank. Screw this, he inspired me. He inspired me like hell. This guy won the tournament. Alright people, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Rate and comment. Don't forget to support the channel. And, well, here you go, imaginary money. Goodbye people!